I know personally, my husband was like, do not attach the dog to your waist. You're going to get dragged. <laughs> but with the proper gear, it was like, ooh, I can walk faster now. And it, you know, it, it's actually more stable with the proper gear than holding a leash, right? Yeah. So if you're holding a leash and your dog is pulling vigorously, that pulling from the shoulder means they're like sort of tipping you forward and you have to really sort of lean back and brace against it so that you don't get pulled over. Um, if you walk far enough in that position, your butt will die. The muscles, <laughs> <laughs> the muscles in your lower back and your butt will be so angry at you. Um, but if you attach them to a belt and just use your hand a little bit while you're learning to help with the rope, with the steering and stuff, um, it, it makes all the difference because like you said, they're pulling you forward. So every time you take a step, you're moving like a couple inches further than you would on your own. It's like free labor. <laughs> right. <laughs> you're not helping you along. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But the, the proper gear is absolutely essential to, to that difference between feeling sort of scared, and unstable versus like, oh my goodness, like this is so much more fun and efficient than walking by myself. Yeah. 